The Trotters have reached the back stretch. And they are underway. Gangster Hanover leaving center of the track takes a slight edge. Outside Max comes up right with him there. Those two separate early on. Two back to third and play tricks on me. Followed at the pylons by Kenogami Coco. Next up is Sorty in fifth. Sylvester America rough gated away on the wide side and the trailer 2 a.m. And Gangster Hanover was able to assert himself and has a clear lead over Max now as they come around the turn to the quarter mile marker and reach in 27 and 4 fifths. On to the front stretch, it's Gangster Hanover. The classy stallion is 1 to 9, was dominant the last time we saw him and out on the front end early. Pocket sitter is Max and Sorty, and uh, excuse me, Sylvester America getting the worst of it on the outside. Parked once again, and he's going to have a hard time getting to the front. Inside fourth now, that's play tricks on me. Second over comes Sorty one last time out. Then Kenogami Coco, 2 a.m. is the trailer, and he is seven off the pace. No real challenge to the lead of Gangster Hanover yet. The half mile, 58, even 30 in one second panel. And with that slowdown, it is going to be tough to catch Gangster Hanover now. He's under wraps and leads it by a length and a quarter, making a length and a half over Max. On the outside, that's Sylvester America singing the first over blues. Blocked in fourth now is Play Tricks on Me. Second over, Sorty is fifth, and he's eight away. Then Kenigami Coco and 2 a.m. Gangster Hanover effortlessly opening up the lead to four as he gets the three quarters, 125 and one. 27 and one, much faster on the back there. And now it's a four length advantage for Gangster Hanover. Max inching forward just a bit. Play tricks on me now as room third. Kenigami Coco fourth. Top of the stretch, Gangster Hanover leads it now by two. Max cutting into it somewhat on the inside third. Play tricks on me, but Gangster Hanover still with a lot left in the tank and now kicks that league out wider once again. Gangster Hanover, the heavy favorite, does not disappoint and wins by five and a quarter. Max was second. Play tricks on me third. Kenogami Coco fourth. Gangster Hanover. George Napolitano Jr. in 153 and one. Uh, good stuff in the second half of the mile after a breather to the half, 58 even. Gangster Hanover closes it out in 55 and 1. And uh, had Max hanging around, play tricks on me, but there was never really a point where you felt like Gangster Hanover was threatened there and gets the victory up front. George, uh, the uh, judges have posted the unofficial order of finish for race number 6. Number 5, Gangster Hanover finished first. Number 7, Max finished second. Number 3, play tricks on me, finished third. And number one, Kenogami Coco finished fourth, unofficially 5-7-3-1 in race number six. Unofficial winner of today's sixth race, number five, Gangster Hanover. He is a four-year-old Bay Stallion by Father Patrick out of Global Desire by Yankee Glide. Bred by Brittany Farms, LLC of Kentucky. Owned by Oka Swanstead, Wrightstown, New Jersey. SRF Stable of Lighthouse Point, Florida. And Brittany Farms of Versailles, Kentucky. Oka Swanstead, the trainer. The meets leading driver, George Napolitano, Jr. in the bike. Gangster Hanover, 1-9 betting favorite. Returning to Pocono for his second win in 10 this year. His other win also here back on August 17th. Seventh lifetime victory. Career earnings now topping $340,000. Time of the mile, 153-1 for five. Gangster Hanover.